It is always nice when you come home to a fragile box. Yo, it's Prime Playboys. Welcome back to another video, man. In today's video, we're going to be doing something different to Dusty. Um, I know you guys have been seeing the videos where of me just doing like performance mods and me fixing stuff on Dusty. Today, we're actually going to do something aesthetic. We're going to make Dusty look better. Um, I don't know if you guys ever heard of me saying this, but I do mention this. I do like to mention this in a lot of my videos. I feel like the knife gens just lack in like, not not performance, just lacks in like appearance in the rear of the car. Well, I think Dusty do. Um, you guys know I did install those canards like probably like a year ago, two years ago. And now in today's video, we're gonna re we're gonna be uh, removing them and installing this bad ass diffuser. So I got this diffuser from Snow Up Most Arrow. Um, I literally just found him on uh, Facebook Marketplace, not Marketplace, the Facebook forums. And he was talking about, oh, I'm starting a website, yada, yada, yada. So I said, you can go check out this man's work. And I'm glad I did because he makes amazing diffusers for the 9th gen, 10th gen, and I believe the 8th gens. And he's doing other cars too. But uh, yeah, anyways, they look amazing. And I was like, yo, this, the one I got looks fire, bro. And it, they're cheap too. Like usually I was looking like, looking at like the Vortex diffuser, which is like 350 for the painted one. I'm like, bro, that's, that's an arm and a leg for a diffuser. But I literally got this diffuser for 230 or 235, which is, that's freaking, that's a good price. And it looks badass. Now, Dusty isn't in the best looking condition right now. Sorry guys for all the little tongue ties. I am kind of sick. I don't know. I don't know if you guys can hear my voice, but yeah, I'm kind of a little sick. But Dusty is not in the best condition right now, as you guys can see. I am on stock tires, stock wheels. Um, the reason why is because um, I was driving home one day for me and my girlfriend being out, and my passenger tire just went out, and I never had the chance to just you know take it to the shop and see what's up but it's definitely not a flat it sounds like a quarter is rolling inside of it so yeah i definitely gotta take off the tire to see what's up i might need a new valve stem so that's the reason why i have the stock wheels back on and um i thought about throwing on the stocks in the front but they have no thread on the tires and i don't want to risk driving like that the next thing you know the car pops and then what well, i'm gonna do then yeah <coughs> But let's get on to installing this thing. It's super, super easy. Um, it actually marks exactly where you need to drill or if you want to drill it. I'm not going to drill it. I'll probably do that on my spare time when it's actually nice outside because right now it looks like it's going to rain and it's kind of hot. But uh, yeah, he says you could drill it. There's no need to take off your bumper. Um, so if the guy who makes it says you could do it, I guess I'm going to do it. And then when I say drill, I mean self-taps. I keep saying drill. He said you could self-tap it to the bumper. And I have my splats on for like probably a year now or a year or two. And I uh, took the car up to speeds of 150 and never had an issue with a splat flying off or a splat getting loose. So it should be the same thing with this diffuser because it's pretty light. And it's made out of ABS, ABS plastic. So yeah, it should be very durable. All right, guys. So I was just checking to see how these uh canards are doing and uh yeah the screws are still there on both sides um i don't need to jack up the car from what i'm seeing and i could just literally just uh take those screws out and put these new ones in all right so car don't need to be off the floor it just needs to be jacked so i'll be able to reach my drill underneath here Five minutes later and boom there goes one I ain't gonna lie for the good for like the amount of time it's been on the car and condition is in it actually doesn't look that bad I mean the black is definitely faded and it's starting to crack on the top but after that it doesn't look that bad it's kind of disgusting though I'm actually kind of happy that I'm removing these because it was just it was just time to be real with you like it is real gunky under here bro I don't know if you guys can see that but it is gunky yeah, camera not not being a uh, camera family. All right, so to install the new ones, I believe it goes like this. If I'm correct, 
Where does it go? Let me see something, bro. How do you jump go, bro? Yeah, this makes more sense. Yeah, buddy. This makes way more sense. All right, we get it somewhere. We are getting somewhere. Well, you guys, it's on the car. But as you guys can see, it's definitely nighttime. And uh, I can't even show you guys. The camera doesn't even focus on the diffuser since it's black. Pause. I sound racist, bro. But uh, yeah, man. So we're just going to finish this video up tomorrow so I can show you guys it. From right here, bro, it looks badass. This is exactly what I like. Exactly what I wanted. Whew. Thing look good. Damn, boy, I'm black. All right, so yeah, see you guys tomorrow, man. All right, you guys. So here's the diffuser, man. You guys can see it, bro. It looks fire. I don't know what you guys think, but I personally love it. I love how aggressive it makes the rear of the car look. If you guys been watching the videos, you guys know that's the main thing I've been talking about on Dusty is how aggressive I want the rear to look. And I can never find that look until I find the diffuser. Now, I was going to get the, vor the Vortex diffuser that everybody always gets. But, man, those things are pricey. And the price I paid for this, I couldn't, like, I couldn't resist on not getting it. And it looks badass. Like, yo, this thing look nice, dog. If you don't like it, bro, you just probably hate him, bro. Deadass. Because, yo, this looks fire. Like, look at the side profile, bro. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at that. Damn, bro. I just need to change the, the stock wheels. Don't worry. That's on the way. But this is where I'm at off the video, you guys. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like, comment, subscribe. Follow your boy on Instagram at underscore got the soda. Head to the merch site, www.zubigarage.com. The reason I'm more... I can't even speak, bro. Like, I have this bad cold. I don't know what it is, but it's killing me right now. Not, not literally, like, not, like, really killing me, but, man, your boy's out. Peace. <laughs>